My name's Beth, and I'm one of the owners of Tybee Island. Tybee Island is about 20 miles out from uh, east of Savannah. Uh, well, it's actually it's the end of the road. <laughs> <laughs> it's the end of Highway 80. Okay. Uh, well, I had a small. I was involved in a small coffee shop in Atlanta about 20 years ago, and um, moved here. And Tybee didn't have a coffee shop. And over the years, they've had a few that come and gone, and we decided in 2013 it was time to to give it a go ourselves. Coffee shop and it's been uh, well received, and a lot of local support. And we've been going strong ever since. Hobby Oaks sure. has been around for maybe 25 years, and it's a little shops over there, and the really anchor for the whole area here is Huck Foods. And it's a park behind us, and it's Pete's Park. Here. It's a family-friendly dive bar. So all the locals hang out. It's a huge um, you know, uh, tourist attraction, too. People love to hang out there when they come to visit the beach. And uh, it's a perfect partner to have to be next to you. Um, well, I'm a fan of cold brew, and we make a great cold brew here. Uh, we use uh, coffee from Bat Dual Food Bronson Roasters in Atlanta, and we use their Bohemian blend, it's a dark roast blend for cold brew. And, that, and especially the Tybee tap water with it, it makes it um, it's just really good. So we just use the toddy system where we steep it overnight, but we do big, big batches because you know, we do a larger volume than we would at home, obviously. So we have like a five gallon setup, and uh, yeah, we steep it overnight, and it's, it's, it's easy, and it's good. And, yeah, well, we're fortunate. I mean, Batdorf, the coffee that we get from them, it's so good that. We, you know, it makes our job a lot easier. We don't have to, have to make it. it, it speaks for itself. It's, it's very good.